Hey there, today I'm diving into how the ketogenic diet could potentially help stroke survivors on the road to recovery. This isn't medical advice, so definitely chat with your healthcare provider before making any big changes. First off, let's talk about neuroprotection and inflammation. When you go keto, your body starts using fat instead of carbs for energy, cranking up ketone bodies like B-hydroxybutyrate or BHB. BHB has some pretty cool anti-inflammatory and antioxidant effects. Given that strokes cause a ton of inflammation and oxidative stress, the ketogenic diet might help cut down on this damage, increasing brain cell survival. Next up, energy metabolism. After a stroke, your brain can struggle to use glucose, leading to an energy crisis. Ketone bodies step in as an alternative fuel, helping brain cells function better and recover. They also promote neuroplasticity, which is key for rebuilding neural connections. Now, let's tackle muscle function and motor ability. Stroke often results in hemiplegia, causing muscle atrophy and metabolic decline. The ketogenic diet can help with muscle regeneration and strength by promoting protein synthesis. Early data even suggests it might boost motor coordination and enhance physical therapy outcomes. What about the evidence? Animal studies like those on rats show that a ketogenic diet can reduce brain swelling and protect neurons post-stroke. Some clinical cases also hint at improvements in cognitive function and physical activity for stroke survivors on a keto diet. Of course, there are advantages and limitations. On the plus side, this diet reduces inflammation, supports neuronal regeneration, and aids muscle recovery. But there are downsides too, like initial side effects and the need for medical oversight. Plus, we still need more large-scale, long-term studies. In conclusion, the ketogenic diet shows promise as a supplementary therapy for stroke recovery. It optimizes energy metabolism, reduces inflammation, and supports neurological healing. But remember, always consult your healthcare provider before making any changes. With more research, who knows, this diet could become a key player in stroke rehabilitation. Thanks for watching.